Hello everyone, Tony Bassett here with Genuine Comfort. I got my buddy Wayne Rapley. He's also co-owner of Genuine. He started it all and we uh, want to talk about a topic which question we get asked a lot and when I go into these older homes uh, the struggle with air conditioning you see the registers on the sidewall versus on the floor and usually they're on the interior wall versus outside where all that load is. So we're going to talk today on why move the floor registers to the outside wall versus um, the sidewall? And in some cases, you just can't do it because you're, unless you redo the whole house, sometimes you're just stuck with what you have. So go ahead, Wayne, talk, let's talk about um, why floor and why against the wall versus the sidewall. Sure. I'll talk about floor first. Uh, those houses designed back then, like mine was a 1947 house. That's a red brick uh, 1947 house. And so all of the supplies were on the interior walls. And then you had a couple of return airs on the exteriors, like by the front door or somewhere else, or a, maybe a huge return air in the floor sitting right in the main pathway. So anyway, the hard part to that is the outside, you're always combating whatever your outside temperature is, whether it's you know, the cold season or the hot season. So what the new housing is done like is you put that supply near right next to the outside wall so it'll kind of help to alleviate that cooler or hotter air that's trying to penetrate come through the windows the doors and make it so it's more even throughout your whole home so that's so and then it have returns in the middle so that it just makes it more comfortable everywhere if you've ever been in a house like what mine used to be we had a return air on an inside wall and a supply on the inside wall and so the outside was always cold. So you, if you set up a bed for one of your kids on the outside, then they were always freezing cold in the wintertime. And in the summertime, the cold would come in and go right back in. And so they were always too hot because they were next to the window. So that's one reason why we do that. Um, but a sidewall versus a, a floor blowing up, if you can't get uh, your, uh, in an air conditioning season, at least three foot tall of air coming up, to mix with the rest of the house it really does no good it stays low the little babies and dogs small dogs and cats they feel the air conditioning they're great but where we're at up high uh, it doesn't ever get up that high so that's why you want it to blow up versus sideways and straight into a return air down low hopefully right. that makes sense yeah and while we're on that subject too and we can make another video on this uh anytime you're doing a remodel you want to do the, the straight metal louver grills versus the decorated yeah. grills or the wood grills if you have hardwood floor. The wood and the decorated grills, even though they look nice, they restrict a lot of airflow. So as Wayne was saying, you want to push that air more than three feet off the ground. Those metal registers are going to do that versus the wood and the decorated registers will not do that. And you're going to be about two to three degrees more comfortable in that area with those metal grills. Especially so. during air conditioning season. Absolutely. So just to give you an idea, most wood grills block 75% of the air. So yeah. they look beautiful, they're nice, but during the summertime, they are not a good answer for air conditioning and having a comfortable house. Right. So I hope uh, this tip helps you today. Um, this is Tony and Wayne, Genuine Comfort. You have a wonderful day and we'll see you.